Are you drinking? Yo, Steph. Steph. Steph put me back on a Nardo wig. He's our twiz. Steph and Nardo wig. And me, three-way twiz. What's going on? Welcome back to another video. Starting this one off at 6 p.m. Jesse James West is in town. You guys probably saw the last video where he was there and he asked me to be in one of his videos and I was like, bro, f yeah. Bro, what a great guy. Like, didn't even ask him the story. I just gave him the sunglasses. He put it on his story. So I definitely appreciate him for that. So shout out to him for that. Headed there now. I'm gonna go train. I'm not gonna film this workout just because Joe's coming back into town tomorrow so we can get like an actual lift lift in. I'm not sure what Steph's doing. Bro, last night, like, so last night we went out and it just made me realize like how much I low-key like don't like it as much i've kind of been i'm kind of over it like it's fun and then you just feel like shit <laughs> like all next day you have like anxiety i don't really get it that often i know some people that do get it pretty often and it sucks like when it's like a hangover but plus like a shit ton of anxiety like tightness in the chest it just sucks yo who's yours is this this shit's fire yellow yours Ooh, clean what up what up bro what's good how you feeling after last night Pretty good, right? Dude, I slept. I slept till like. Oh, I know, bro. That's why I was asking, bro. Like, <laughs> I, you, I, I, slept so I was like, yo, did he like get home? Like, because like, you didn't respond for a fucking no. minute. Literally, I'm telling y'all, I'm done going out. Keep me accountable, like once a month, or if there's like some type of event, yeah. Because I'm just. It's get, for work. Yeah, it's for work. You got to. Yeah, like if like Gary's like, yo, like let's go, whatever. I'll do that, but like birthdays only, Christmas, like, <laughs> going fucking out, Thanksgiving, crazy, like Thanksgiving, dude. I'm going out, bro. Casual drinks, that's cool, but the club, f that shit, bro. Say what's up, bro. Damn! Yo, I've never seen this car in person. What's up, bro? All right, I'm, but it's I'm, like an Easter egg, you know what I mean? I'm a taxi driver. Yeah, yeah. so it's like a funny fake way. taxi? Like, you're gonna be an Uber. Wait, is this like a fake taxi thing? <laughs> Sure. All right, we're, we're on a fake taxi. Just drive all the way up. What do you like? You got like a script there? for me? Got and that's all. I just like yeah. all up the top. Right. 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 Up the top. Up the top. And then, what's your and, name? And, you then and then I'll be like, I'll be like, what's your name? I'll be like Brandon. <laughs> yeah, I'll be like I'm Brandon. Like nice to meet you, Brandon. Like, yeah. Yeah, you just pull up like right to like the the Alpha Land sign. Yeah. Like, perfect. So we're picking him up for a skit. But I didn't tell him I'm gonna do this. When I pick him up, I'm just gonna fucking launch it forward, and like no one, like we won't tell him, and he's gonna be really confused, and he's gonna be like, bro, you ruined my shit. It's good exposure for Boulevard, man. <laughs> oh yeah, my bad. <laughs> for Jesse? Yeah? Yo, all right, Brandon? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, I'll, I'll not. <laughs> all right, go. Hey, how's it going? Yep. Uh, you got the address? Going to Alpha Land, right? Yeah, Alpha Land, please. Okay. Awesome, thanks, bro. Yeah. You got a nice car? Thanks. Is it like a uh, 2015? Yeah, it's actually a 2016 different model. Oh, okay, yeah, got you, got you. How Same. long have you been Ubering for? Six months, bro. How's it going? Pretty good. I bought this car. Oh, Pretty sick, good, sick. Yeah. Paying well. Yeah. Awesome. Mine's shutting up. <laughs> uh, like any music? Um, honestly, anything works. I like. Uh, oh my god. Okay. Holy shit. Oh my god. Gym's closing soon. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you know, right up here by this uh, big Alpha Line signs. Okay. That's fine. Yeah. Cool, man. Awesome, bro. Yeah. Enjoy your workout. Give, give me five stars, please. Yeah, I got you, bro. Oh, I thought you were going to leave me. My bad, bro. Thanks, bro. Have a good day. Peace out, guys. Be safe. Is that funny? Or is it corny? Yo, let me know no, if that's no, corny. No, let me know if that's corny. Funny. <laughs> was it good? <laughs> All right. Cool. Shut up. Cool. <laughs> no, that was, was really good. good. That was good. That's hilarious. Thank you, bro. <laughs> yeah, of course, bro. I appreciate it. We'll see you guys it. in there. We'll see you in there, yeah. 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 My, my actor shit, bro. <laughs> LA changed you, bro. Dude, LA actually changed me. Now I'm doing skits. I'm doing skits, improv. Honestly, though, if I were to do anything, it'd be improv. Because I was all off the dome, you know? I'm just funny like that, you know what I'm saying? I was scared. Bro, honestly, do you think you were going to lose the grip on that? I was launch? trying to. That first launch, it felt like you lost it. I was trying to. I, I was trying to, like, fucking drift to make it funnier. <laughs> Sometimes I forget this is not an SUV. Holy shit. Dude, that's fucked up. <laughs> You, you, can't. you couldn't even put a dollar bill in it. No, no. Why didn't you tell me? We were just talking about how you have a like front facing camera, so it shows you exactly where this yeah. shit is. We're like, dude, the front facing camera's cool, bro. Like, <laughs> but yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah. Harry got a little excited. This is really cool. You got a little excited, bro. Wet dream? <laughs> put it up on the screen. Eric, put up the. Put up the yeah, no. Hey, you play the Tearaway Jogger commercial right here. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? You got any napkins, bro? I got you. <laughs> Yo, thanks, man. Tell me that shit's not fucking dope. That's, that's better marketing than Nike. We that's did, what so we, we up with that, filmed it, and posted it in like ten minutes. <laughs> For real. <laughs> we came up. We were like, bro, where's a condiment? We need a condiment. <laughs> we found ranch. Ranch pants. Ranch pants. <laughs> Jesse was nice enough to give me these. These are medium. 
These kind of look dope. Like, <laughs> it's a style. It's European. Yeah, it's Euro. Yeah. And I got the 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 crossbody. I literally look like I'm Euro. Oi, mate. <laughs> yeah, race mode's crazy. You gotta be a little careful. Joe's back. I think you learned your lesson there, Say bro. Say what's up. Hey, what's up? Joe's back, baby. Jesus Christ, bro. A little burps going on. Yeah. Jeez, bro. School zone. <laughs> Yeah. All right, so we are on our way to a little photo shoot. I'm sitting in the back. I always forget this car has two seats. It's, it's there are only four seats. We're going to shoot the October 18th drop, and I want to show you guys because it's a drop that I'm really excited for because there is an item like there's a there's a long sleeve and then there's joggers and like that's normal for everybody. But there is a Teddy Fleece T-shirt that I personally love. We're focusing on that because that's an item that like I want to wear a lot. This is like the next month or two is just going to be crazy. And then we'll relax a little bit in like February. But like here until the end of the year and then January, it's fucking grind mode, head down, stay busy, stay productive. You know, we're on our shit. Yeah, because obviously there's like kids, you know. The kids, man. I'm getting public in <laughs> <laughs> I like that rack, bruv. Let's go, we don't got all day. You got three, bro. We got a prep, we got a prep guy over here. Yeah. Wash. Yeah, no, black wash is really nice. Yeah. They've never done like a long sleeve like that. Got on white with brown cloud foam. So new cloud foams, just bag gear. These are probably top top three jogger they've made behind the travel cargoes. Travel cargoes will forever be undefeated. They've already dropped a style like this, but it was short sleeve, if you guys remember, with the young LA on the side. But now this is like a long sleeve version. I'm gonna go put the camera down, get busy, and I'm gonna come back and talk to you guys about the Teddy Fleece, because I fucking, I'll show you real quick. <laughs> yes. Like, I'm like, I'm, I fucking love this shirt. I love this shirt. So, this is the Teddy T. Like, I'm stoked. I fucking love this shirt. This is a size large. I was wearing XL, and I was like, bro, honestly, it's a little bit too baggy. So I sized down to the large, and now it's like a perfect fit. Because the sleeves are a little bit long. Yeah, the sleeves are long, so like when you put, if you have some size on you, like size down, it'll be a little bit tighter. Super sick. Also, new hats as well. Black rose hat. But look, let me switch up the vibe. Like, I'm going to show you how quick I'm about to switch the vibe up real quick. And now it's like classy as f These are Young LA Dapper Pants. They're a little bit short on me, so I'm just sagging them a little bit for the photo shoot, but... If you go out, I swear to God, you're gonna get compliments. It's happened to me. People are gonna be like, "Bro, I like your shirt." Every, like guys and girls, they're gonna be, they're gonna like want to feel your shit. If, and also, if you're big, you're in the gym, like make sure you're pumped up, and they're gonna feel you, and then flex up real quick. And they're like, "Damn, like you've been working out." So, bro, there's so many like, so that's why I'm really passionate about it. I really do love it. I had no idea. Switch the vibe up again. <laughs> Uh, yeah, like if I go out like this, bro, I swear all the girls gonna be on me, like the smart girls. Like if I go to Barnes and Nobles right now, I mean mad girls on me. All right, we're about done though. We're gonna head back, and then tomorrow my dad's coming in in town. He's gonna help me out around the house for a few days because we do have some shit to we got some shit to fix up in the house before we move out. We'll see you guys when we see you. All right, what's up guys? Um, we are at the gym. My dad's still at the crib, he's working. He was like, I was like, yo, kinda gotta go train. He was like, oh yeah, bro, of course. So, you know, I'm making a little quick workout so I can go back, have some beers and pops, you know. It was gonna be me, Madrid, and my dad. Cause Madrid knows my, he used to work, Eric used to work for my dad back in the day. Like we all used to work at my barbecue restaurant. And it was like a two week span where Eric was working. And then Eric like, I, I don't know if he quit or if he got fired, but like <laughs> pretty much my parents were like, all right, we're good, we're good on Eric. So now we're just chilling. But we're gonna go train. We're gonna do like a little shoulders, like a light shoulder and then maybe like some biceps. Um, just get some blood flow. Joe, behind the camera, was feeling like he didn't really want to train hard and I get it. So we're just gonna chill. <laughs> we're just gonna chill. So, all right, let's get into it. About it. Oh wait, I, well honestly I haven't trained, dude, it's 7 p.m. Bro, where's the day? I woke up at nine today. I have no idea. Sorry, I slept in a little bit. I woke up at nine. <laughs> where's the day gone, bro? You know, shit just happens when you're busy. You made it to the gym. Yeah, worked. Well, my dad worked and I kind of like helped out a little <laughs> bit and it's crazy. He just loves this shit. He literally lives for this. So, all right, let's go train. Come on. Look at this. 
Summer shredding, 13 through 16. <laughs> we're gonna be in LA. <laughs> That's literally when we're going to LA. Yeah, we're going to LA, so. We got some other shit to do. Well, there's gonna be like a million people. I'm not gonna say who. There's like, gonna be some huge names not here. Yeah. <laughs> over in LA. Some are lying, you know? Some are young. We're young summer in. Oh, that's fire. Yeah. Some are shredding. We're young summer in. All right. We in gym two. I've been gone for two weeks and also a different time. So there's a lot of like weird, like weird people. They're not weird. Like I'm just saying it's weird seeing new people. That's not, I'm not calling them weird. We're all a little bit weird. We were like, okay, let's take it easy. And then we decided to do literally the hardest shoulder exercise. Besides the standing up one, this is like second hardest right here. Okay, that's the only way to make gains, so. Bro, what? <laughs> what? You never see, you never seen people like spit on a court? To get the dust. You get the, you get the dust off the bottom of your shoe. Well, disgusting. I swear to God, dude, that's what people do. Like, it's not gross. It's not gross. I don't want people to think that's not a thing. Like, that's actually a thing, especially outside. Like, I wouldn't do that outside, inside. Yeah. I wouldn't do that inside, but like, uh, over here. Like, look. It's just so like, so now. The shooting, there's a shooting pain up my elbow. <laughs> ah, it's like my whole, my, my two fingers right here are numb. Like this side of my, my hand is numb. Creature, bro. We're going four plates. We gotta we gotta max out. Remember last last time we did this one? Three plates? We gotta go four. Yo, new meme. Alright, so we had the we had the fit bot or dad bot meme, but we're past that. Now it's what's what's like a or no, Fitbot or Dadbot is such a good meme though. Like, yeah. Fitbot or Dadbot always like comes back. It finds its way back. It's just such a good one, bro. Like, Fitbot or Dadbot. So fast, comes up the comes up the tongue. Fitbot, Dadbot, you know? Hey, Joe's training for Malibu. There's a big photo shoot in Malibu for Young LA. Only girl athletes, so Joe's like, you gotta get right. Joe's trying to get right. I'm training him. Three weeks, shredded. Let's go, prep for Malibu. 21 days out. Go, <laughs> oh, baby. Hey, Malibu. I'm not even going. Three weeks out. I'm not even going, but Malibu, baby. I blacked out in the middle of the set. I didn't even know I put these on, bro. In the middle of that set, I had an idea. Cause I was thinking like, damn, I really don't have that much room in my apartment. I should get a storage locker. Huge smart. Yeah, cause I was like, damn, I kinda wanna bring my golf clubs to LA. <laughs> even though I haven't, I haven't golfed in a year. I have this really nice set of clubs. And I was like, where would I put them? And then I was like, storage unit. Going? Yeah. All right, y'all remember when I was in Miami and I was like, Marco, I'm saying it on camera because I want it to be like set in stone. We're finally gonna start working on the Jack Italian collab for Boulevard because now we're starting to get like the ball rolling on everything. So I want to have that in like a, within a couple of months. So if you guys are a Marco fan and you're a sunglass fan, I'm gonna combine the two. Just want to like give you guys a heads up on that. And there's gonna be like more collabs too because I want to honestly get everybody involved because that's something sick. Like they can design their own pair, you know? There's so many, like, there's so much shit you can do, you know? I can do an Alphalete pair. Everyone can benefit. I can do a Lascelles pair, bro. I can do whatever the 
the fuck I want. Yo, action <laughs> shout out. LaSalle is officially an LLC. Let's pop some fucking champagne for that. Go upstairs. CG's like, CG's like, what are y'all doing? We're like, we're like, LaSalle to LLC. He's like, fuck yeah, bro, let's get fucked up. But yeah, that's actually pretty exciting because we got that done. Somebody has LaSalle.com. This guy's a fucking dickhead. He emailed <laughs> Gary and was like, yo, like, I've got LaSalle.com. I'll give you 5K for it. And we're like, oh, I don't know, I don't know. Didn't res he didn't respond to us for a minute. Came back the other day and said 20 bands for LaSalle.com. <laughs> we wrote him an email and I said, pretty much said, you. There what his name was. There's no. His name was Jack Meoff. <laughs> and Gary at the time didn't know. And he was looking through my following for a Jack Meoff. But then he realized it's Jack Jack Meoff. So he wants 20 bands. I wrote him an email. I said, bro, you're not gonna sell this to anybody else. No one else can wants this. And that someone wants to flip it to us. So if you guys want to buy it for 20k, go ahead. But I'm not paying 20k for it. I said, we said four thousand seven dollars for every day you don't respond, a dollar amount gets taken away. So f that kid. When you're not getting 20 bands, we don't even need the domain that bad bro it's just gonna sell itself i'm not we're never getting that domain now we're good with the domains we have right now so all right that's the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed i want to go home uh have some beers and just chill bro pat myself on the back i've been fucking grinding i've got like vids stacked up we got new york coming up i'm caught up on like young la shit i want to do another shoot we're doing reels la's changed me bro like i'm moving too fucking fast out here bro everyone else can't keep up i'm already on the next thing I'll see you guys in New York if that's where we're going next video. I don't know. Maybe next video we're back here. Who knows? Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next one.